Hi, hello and welcome to Tech Blob YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to show you how to configure SyncToy software. Okay, to do that, this is called backup system uh, software. Now, I'm going to install. Uh, before the installation, you need to uh, install the pre-request software uh, Microsoft.NET Framework 2.0 Service Pack 1. Okay, uh, in this software, I have already installed in the system for other installation purpose. Now, to do that, the SyncToy uh, software, I'm going to right click run as an administrator and click yes and tick mark and go to next and agree the terms and conditions click next and here the installation folder goes to the c drive program files and sync toy folder okay and uh, click next and next the installation started and completed now okay now uh, keep update your system every day it's better and now I'm going to close this all right now we need to find the sync toy software go to the start menu and this is the software which we installed right now and open the software and if you want to participate you can all right uh, I'm going to give okay I don't want now this is the module sync toy software I'm going to create a new backup folder this is easy to copy every day daily backup now I'm going to create a new folder and the destination where you want to take a uh, copy the destination folder browse the location and I'm going to give desktop I have uh, files uh, the text files and confidential personal these are the my testing purpose I have created three folder here and I'm going to choose multiple selections I think not possible uh, one by one you need to copy or else the three folder you can keep in one folder all right now I'm going to take a copy the confidential folder and click OK and the destination where do you want to copy and browse the location I have a 3 terabyte hard drive external so this is the better option to uh, keep in, in one external hard drive in case uh, you have a system crash or anything happen in your operating system without data loss uh, you can keep it in, in one drive all right I'm gonna choose the I'm going to give a name my desktop files all right this is the folder I'm going to choose and click OK now the both destination is we have a configured and click next and here there is three options synchronizing and uh, the echo options and uh, contribute and I'm going to choose the contribute options and click next here you have to type the name the folder name backup files and click finish now the sync toy configuration is done and this is uh, the normal backup module daily you need to click uh, run options so this is hard to uh, do that every day so we have a daily backup configurations setup is there uh, we can go to the task scheduler 
to do that go to the start menu and or else you can type run command task schd dot msc this is the shortcut task scheduler all right and once the task scheduler is open you have to create a basic task click on that and once the create a basic task is open give the name daily backup and description i'm going to leave the blank if you want you can fill it for remember the folder and click next and here there are options daily weekly monthly one time like that options is available i'm going to choose my case a daily backup okay click next and the date when you want to start the daily backup uh, the date current date i'm going to start and the time right now my system time is 11 47 uh, i'm going to give the 11 50 because uh, we need to do some configurations also 11 50 00, 00 seconds pm okay click next start program and uh, browse the location there is a script for daily backup uh, when you install the sync toy software you will get the uh, c drive program files and inside there is a sync toy folder sync toy cmd files is available open that and here in the box add arguments there you have to type hyphen capital r is the command click next and finish it and now the backup system going to start this time every day uh, i will show you how the process is going to start before that i'm going to open my hard drive go to the file explorer this is the folder which i created my desktop files okay and this is the destination i need to copy to the destination to my external hard drive let's see how the process is going to start because we have uh, done the task scheduler configuration as, as well let's see the process right now when the time 11:50 is going to the process is going to start and this is the cmt command it's now open now you can see the test file I have a created in the desktop confidential folder. There is a the small text file I have a created for the testing purpose. The daily backup system automatically started to dump into my external hard drive. This is safest the way you can keep one external hard drive because there is no data loss you will get daily backup files okay this is the way how to configure sync toy software and uh, configuring the step by step and thank you for watching this video uh, dear friends please like and share subscribe the tech blob youtube channel